IEA Toolkit Video – Primary versus Secondary Energy Primary energy commodities are captured directly from natural resources. Primary heat can be captured from natural sources such as nuclear fission, solar thermal collectors, or geothermal reservoirs. Primary electricity is obtained from sources such as hydro, wind, solar PV, tide and wave power, where the first practical measuring point of energy is electricity. For renewables, primary sources are those which can be extracted naturally, like solar, wind, hydro, tidal, wave, or fuel wood. Coal, mined directly from the ground, is a primary energy. This includes anthracite, coke and coal, bituminous coal, sub-bituminous coal, and lignite. Oil, as a primary fuel, exists as crude oil, natural gas liquids, and other hydrocarbons. Natural gas is a primary fuel composed primarily of methane. Transformation changes the form of the energy. Secondary energy sources are obtained from transformation and are produced to respond to user needs when primary sources are not suitable. For example, could we use crude oil directly in cars or boilers? No, because crude oil has highly variable mixture of hydrocarbon molecules, so there is no universal engine for it. We need a transformation to turn it into usable products. Secondary fuels are obtained from primary fuels through the process of transformation. This diagram shows a basic commodity flow. Primary commodities undergo transformation and result in secondary commodities. Secondary electricity and heat are produced after transformation of another energy source, such as burning fossil fuel. This transformation can occur in a power plant, combined heat and power plant, or pure heat plant. A secondary renewable energy is charcoal, which is produced from fuel wood. Secondary coal includes both solid and gaseous fuels produced after transformation. Secondary coal products are then used in many industrial processes, such as steel manufacturing. Oil products are secondary fuels. Crude oil inputs into a refinery, which produces oil products, such as gasoline, residual fuel oil, heavy gas oil, diesel, kerosene, jet fuel, naphtha, butane, and lighter products. In this process, crude oil can be thought of as primary energy, while refined products are secondary. For more details on this and other key concepts of energy statistics, please go to our Energy Statistics Manual and the International Recommendation on Energy Statistics.